Are you running AMD Adrenaline software to keep your drivers up to date on your graphics card? Are you having massive issues with crashing in-game? For me in particular, Modern Warfare 3. Well, don't worry. I've been doing some reading, and I think I found a solution that's going to work for you because it definitely worked for me. So don't go anywhere, and we'll get right into it. All right, here's the super pathetic part of the video. Listen, everybody, I've got tons of views. You guys are digging the content. I'm not getting many subscribers. Can you please, please, please subscribe to the content so we can get this whole PC giveaway guy thing going? All right, so first, let's talk a little bit about some of the issues we're having. I basically, every time I was launching my game, it seemed to me it all started happening I think it was, um, I'm going to say it was early October, and now I am not an authority. This is just what I've noticed, and it you know it may not be related, but what's worked for me um, and what I've noticed is what I'm going to share with you here, guys. So what, what was happening is every time I launch a game, I'm crashing. It was driving me nuts. I could play like some games, but it would seem like I had the wrong drivers installed, like weird artifacting was happening with lights and stuff, and I've... I've gone through uh, my settings, I've gone through my drivers, I've reinstalled my operating system, I've pulled all of my hair out. <laughs> it got to the point where I'm just like, I don't know what to do anymore. It came down to what you should do if you were there is go to Reddit and let's bring up the Reddit screen here. And here you can see, here's someone else having a similar issue where they're listing their specs here. I'm not going to get into all of it, but they're saying they've overclocked it, put into hours stress testing, blah, blah, blah. I tried deleting everything, reinstalling, tried Steam. I tried all that too. They're using battle.net. Um, went to the previous version, used DDU, which I tried that too. Uh, that's just a uninstalling um, software. Um, so I tried lowering the VRAM, tried that too, even though I've got 24 gigs, so definitely not my issue. Anyways, let's get right into it here. So this needs to be a big shot out to him, but if when we get to the end of his, it actually is, uh, he doesn't send a proper shot out, but this is from another person. So this is trailed information. So here we go. I'm going to read it to you and then I'm going to show it to you. Okay. So he says, go to AMD Adrenaline, perform tuning, enable manual GPU tuning, Change the DPU base marker clock speed to match your card manufacturer. For some reason, AMD set my 7900 XTX to 3000, where the card base is 2615 for my XFX uh, Merc. Uh, this fix is all direct X crash on AMD. I tried a hundred different resolutions, including BIOS reinstall. I just updated my BIOS. That's why I'm laughing. Uh, hardware reinstart thousand forum topics that was me and i stumbled across his uh until i came across this fix from some genius and it never crashes so i wish he would have forwarded who it was i'm just gonna say it was this dude here infamous top 9716 you're the man for passing this on because you've like literally saved me huge amounts of frustration and irritation so what I'm going to do is I am going to unpack all that for you guys right here, and I'm going to show you what that translates into. So for me, I am running this card that you see on your screen here. Now, this is the AMD Radeon's RX 7900 XTX Gaming Trio Classic 24 gig card. Okay. So here we are in AMD Adrenaline. Here's the home screen. If you click on the performance tab, and once you've hit that, you go over to tuning here. Okay, when you get into the tuning tab here, what you wanna do is you wanna look, I've got, you may not have a AMD CPU, that doesn't matter, but in the GM, G, in the GMC, in the GPU, <laughs> what you're gonna do is uh, right here where it says GPU tuning, you're gonna click enable. What you're gonna also wanna do here is you're want, gonna wanna take advanced control of this. And now see, uh, mine is currently set, and this was my problem. Mine was set, I think it was at like 29.57. Again, I altered this for the video because I didn't, I didn't record this live when this happened, when I got this all sorted out. So it was here. So now, if yours is having this issue and your max frequency is set at like 3000 or whatever it's set at, you should go here to whichever your manufacturer is, doesn't matter who it is, go there, 
when you look under their core clock section right here, the core clock speed in megahertz says that uh, gaming up to 2300. Uh, I tried that and that was actually 100% my solution. Um, I was doing some video editing, so I clicked it up to boost mode to 2500 megahertz and it actually, afterwards I played Modern Warfare 3 and it performed quite well. So in this video, I'm gonna be putting it up to the 2500. So we'll go back here to AMD Adrenaline. What's handy here is you can just go like this, type 2500. Now, what you're gonna wanna do before you forget is click apply changes here, okay? So once you've applied the changes, everything should be tickety-boo. Um, what we'll do is I'll show you, I'll launch into game and I'll just cut it into like 30 seconds of, of intermittent gameplay and showing you all the way to the end that I was able to exfil. And it's been honestly, Oh man, since week two of the last season that came out, I started having really crippling issues. Before that, I was struggling to get by. I suspect it's due to that uh, uh, that October update for AMD Adrenaline. Now, I don't know, I was monkeying around with this months ago, but since then I've had all sorts of issues where I've reinstalled my operating system and everything. I had a clean install of AMD Adrenaline. so unless this was a setting that somehow i monkeyed with and was saved i'm not saying that that's not possible so uh, all i'm saying is if you go in here you check yours and if your card manufacturer is listing 25 or whatever it's listing and it's got you set way higher crank this down this is your fix bam All right, well, that's all I got for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. As always, be kind to each other, and I will see all of you in the next video.